What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today I got a Tom McDonald reaction coming your way. This one is White Boy. Looks like this one was dropped probably about five years ago, so probably right at the beginning of when he really blew up. Uh, I'm excited to see what he's talking about on this one, just by the title alone. Probably gonna be controversial. Maybe that's what uh, got got him labeled as this. Tons of people recommended this one, so uh, I'm excited to get into it and see what he's talking about. Let's go ahead and hop right into it. If you're new here and you enjoy this reaction video, make sure you smash that subscribe button for me. Like this video, share this video. Uh, we're growing this channel, man, on the road to 1K right now. Thank you guys so much for all your support. Let's go and hop right into it. Tom McDonald, white boy. I cannot feel guilty for that I didn't do, but I can understand the reasons why you think that I should. Okay. Yeah, I'm white, but I... All right, so not even 10 seconds in, man. Uh, he, he really came with it. Uh, I can already see where this is going. He's in a classroom setting. Raising his hand, speaking to a teacher, basically saying, uh, you know, his first lines were, let me take that. I didn't do, but I can understand the reasons why you think that I should. Yeah, I'm white, but I never put your neck in no noose. And I never burnt a cross or hit my face with a hood. You can't just label me racist because I'm related to people who did some terrible way back before I was alive. Mm. My parents brought me up to treat everyone as an equal. I refuse to feel ashamed because of my pretty blue eyes. And I'm some white supremacist. Anyone who labels me as that because of my family genetics. The hate for Caucasians is so pathetic. Go be proud that you're black, but don't hate me for some credit. I'm not the white. Okay, he's saying a lot on this one. Uh, he's basically saying, you know, yeah, I'm white. My ancestors did some pretty terrible things back in the day. But uh, there's nothing I could do about it. And I'm not going to, you know, be guilty about the things that, uh, you know, did happen that I had no part of is kind of what I'm picking up off that. And of course, you got the dude right here who looks pretty offended. You know, he's looking around like, oh, my God, is he really saying this? But, uh, you know, that's kind of how the world is right now. You know, there, there's blame all the way around. You know, it's just uh, a cra crazy time where, you know, we're living in right now. Uh, tensions seem like they're very high, but... Uh, yeah, he's saying a lot on this. Uh, I could see this is probably the song that got him a lot of hate, right? Uh, <laughs> you know, not many, uh, not many people are gonna be talking about this in their song. So, uh, yeah, let's let's see what he's talking about. So pathetic. Go be proud that you're black, but don't hate me for some credit. I'm not the white devil, neo Nazi cop trying to pull the trigger. You can call me what you want, but I'd still never say. Ooh. The white race as a whole ain't the enemy. There's racist white people, but we're far from that collectively. Thanks. That is true. Uh, obviously, there's going to be racist people. There will always be racist people just because, uh, you know, no matter what we do, I feel like there's always going to be bad people out there. Just like murderers, you know, um, obviously everybody knows not to murder, but guess what? We still have murderers. We still have rapists out here. Um, you know, things like that. So it, uh, in my opinion, it'll never go away no matter what you do. Some people are just like that. Some people, you know, think they need to stick to their own kind. Uh, it's just... You know, some people are just like that. They have hate in their heart. Uh, there's nothing you can really, really do about that. Obviously, you can, you know, you can uh, try your hardest, you know, which I feel, uh, you know, like he said, we're, we're far, we're far from that collectively compared to how it was, you know, even 50 years ago. So uh, we definitely are making strides for a better future. But, uh, you know, like I said, it's just the there will always be hateful people out there no matter what you do. It's just really something you cannot control. You know, if it was as easy as being able to control everybody and making them good people, you know, the world would be a better place. We would have already done it. So, you know, unfortunately, it is what it is. Don't say that, white boy. Oh, you so bad, white boy. You wish you were black, white boy. Be white boy. White boy, white. No, say it. Can't say it. on some cognac sitting next to me i don't assume that every black's favorite drink is hennessy i don't dislike tanisha because her first name isn't stephanie not only is that wrong it's a waste of energy Max. ivory or epic so yeah he said a lot right there too uh pretty much you know some of the stereotypes um you know black people like in hennessy you know he says he doesn't assume that every black person enjoys hennessy because it's not true uh stereotypes are there but you know uh, not everybody falls into that category of you know what what they do so um yeah he's saying a lot on this 45 or 17 we all bleed the same martin luther king or kennedy Ooh. they're angry i'm <laughs> reciting he said we all bleed the same martin luther king or kennedy then the gunshot because they you know they both got taken out uh that that's crazy that's tough 
bleed the same Martin Luther King or Kennedy They're angry I'm reciting the facts He's white and he rats And stole the culture right from the facts Okay, he's fire, but we lit the flame We siphon and gas So this corny little honky man The whitey is whack We letting history perpetuate the hatred within And then you paint me with the brush You painted slave owners with Ooh. Yeah, white boy Don't say that An uncle and a grandma that I picture when you're openly hating And God willing, one day I'll have a kid of my own I refuse to let you blindly hate my wife and my baby So go ahead and hate the races I pray for their extinction If you want to hate the white people, just make the distinction Between the ones who want the best for everyone regardless And the ones who build the system just to smother you with yes. Stop before you say it that's another thing too, man, is, you know, you do have those people out there that, that blame all white people for, you know, certain issues, but... Uh, if you really look at the bigger picture here, it's not it's not your regular white person that's holding anybody back. It's the ones in power. We have no control over that. At least I don't. You know, I, I have no control over any of this whatsoever. Uh, you know, a majority of us do not. And if it was up to us, you know, we wouldn't. You know, we wouldn't. We wouldn't allow that. So, uh, you know, I kind of get what he's saying on there. I do. I can see why this probably uh, started quite a controversy. You know, people don't want to hear stuff like this. But, uh, you know, I think it's good to get a conversation going. You know, some things do need talked about, and this is one of them. So, especially with the, you know, state the world is in right now, or the United States is in. I know what you've been thinking. How's a straight white male in 2018? You're making me the villain by demonizing my race. For things I didn't do and decisions I didn't make. No one that I call a friend has ever owned a slave. And neither did our dads or our dad's dads. Sakes acknowledging atrocities were wrongly committed. It's all that I can offer when I'm wrongly convicted. Ooh. I would never hate a man for what God gave him in pigments. And I would never plot against him just because he is different. Nice. I would never judge a human for the cards he was given or call him less than myself because of the race that he's mixed with white people that you hate aren't your neighbors or lawyers they're the rockefellers rothschilds uh, Bushes, there we go that's exactly what i'm talking about monopolized the water and oil and injected your communities with drugs that yes. is oil got no patience for nazis i think they're better off dead the fighting hatred with hatred making the hate more intense i don't want nothing to do with either side of the fence so don't blindly attack me for wearing braids on my head hate the people who believe you put yourselves in the ghetto hate the ones who teach their children you ain't because they said so hate the ones who think you're all the same and judge you profusely because the way that you're portrayed on our news and in movies being white and being racist aren't the same and i promise no it's hard to tell the difference if i'm just being honest i, I like this video too. to show you i'm not part of the problem and you owe it to yourselves we got so much in common that's true too man we we have a lot in common more than you think uh, you know, even if you sit down and have a conversation with one another, you know, even of different races, we have so much in common. We really do. Uh, people would literally just take the time out and speak to one another. And, and, you know, you would realize that we're, I mean, we're really, we all pretty much live the same lives. We go, you know, a lot of us go through some of the similar stuff throughout life. So, um, there's, there's a lot of similarities between everybody. I don't think people, you know, most people realize that. Like how he's getting paper thrown at him. Good video, really good video. But uh, yeah, I really don't. You I mean I understand why it probably pissed a lot of people off. But then again, if you if you really listen to the message deep down in the song, it's beautiful. It's a beautiful message all the way around. He's basically saying, you know, just just stop judging people. We can all get along. We really can. So, um, you know, put all the bullshit aside. Have a conversation with one another. Uh, we're we're pretty similar. Like he said, we're pretty similar in a lot of ways. So, um. Yeah, really enjoy this one, man. Let me know down below what other Tom McDonald I should react to. Uh, the one with the most likes I'll probably do next. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for supporting. Until next time.